Welcome to episode eight of the Kids of Culture podcast. I'm your host, Narayan. Guys, introduce yourselves. Your is the co-host, Shakai. You know the vibes. What's up? It's Tyler. What's good? It's your boy, Zach. What's good? It's your local white boy, Matt. All right, man, let's get into it. So we're talking about unpopular opinions today. Um, I'm going to start. And y'all, y'all can get pissed all you want, but... Michael Jordan in this era would be nothing more than DeMar DeRozan is. That's facts. That is I mean, facts. That's, that's facts. facts. That's facts. That's facts. You can't argue that. That's facts. That's facts. That's facts. You can't shoot. I'm neutral on this one, bro. I'm neutral. Hey, yeah, you right. Yeah, the shooting part. Yeah. I'm neutral. Yo, there's anything else, bro. Y'all are com- Oh, hell no. Just- bro, DeMar DeRozan yeah. and Michael Jordan's time would be better than Clyde Drexler was. He's that athletic, yes, yes. He, he He's a mid-range savant, yes. Not being able to shoot in today's I mean, era is not, not, like not going to work. Saying, it's not like he's saying DeMar's shit. Line, DeMar's still, like, pretty decent. Having a jumper in today's era is, like, kind of a necessity. Literally. You, you need a jumper yeah. to be able to succeed. And, and that's why Jordan and LeBron are different, because LeBron does so much more other than what he does on all. I mean, I mean Jordan, he probably be he probably be a little bit better than DeMar DeRozan, but I don't I don't think he's gonna be a top ten player in the league. When he was being developed though, the coaches wouldn't have back then they didn't focus on the three point line, did they? As much as they are now. Man, right. if he was in this league, he'd be this getting the same development. Deep. There was not a single zone defense back then. It was called illegal defense. It was man to man Like Players now are going against zone defenses built to stop them, built to double team. He would not survive. He would not score, like people say, he would not score 40 points per game in this era because defenses are bad. People are more athletic nowadays. There's six, nine point guards guarding six, three point guards nowadays. I, I mean, look at Ben Sa- I, I, was I mean, about to say ben Simmons Simmons. Zone, I mean, think about uh, the 76ers zone defense is probably OD or any any type of big lineup like the Nuggets when they have all their big their zone defense. Oh fucking C. Okay. I can't even argue at this point. Yeah, bro. If you go to get a zone, my nigga, and you cannot like shoot on that yeah. high, bro. I'm sorry, you're not getting you're not gonna survive. Yeah, because there's <clears throat> there's somebody guarding the middle. There's somebody covering the two outsides, and they're everybody's long enough nowadays. But I'm gonna say some teams are gonna be lanky as hell, and they're gonna run different lineups with that zone. So my nigga, exactly. Different. Some some teams literally. Oh, okay, Matt, why why do you disagree? You act like he wouldn't have been when when you come into the league. Not, I mean, the development back then was different because the league was run different. If he would have been. If he would have been playing in today's era, he would have been coached, developed differently. I mean, it's the league, the develop, training for the rookies progresses with the era. You're saying that like he wouldn't have been trained any different. I mean, you can, a shooter's a shooter. You have a point. I mean, DeMar DeRozan is not being trained to this league. I mean, he's, 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 he's not, not everybody's trained to shoot jumpers. Especially um, under Greg Popovich. Greg Popovich isn't a huge three-point shoot kind of guy. I get that, but it's... <clears throat> I mean, because we're, we're, I mean, DeMar, DeMar right now, he's in a great system, not thriving. He's at the latter stages of his career, though. No, he's not. Whoa. No, he's, he's like 30, is he not? Nigga. Yeah, I think DeMar's like 36. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> DeMar isn't like fucking Vince Carter age. Shit. I mean, DeMar can still put up 25 on a good night. Consistently. Yeah. It's not like like championship caliber. It's not like, I wouldn't say like Toronto DeMar, but he's still DeMar. Yeah, like. Exactly. Still a top 10 shooter guard in the league. Wow. Wow. But but I want to hear what y'all got, unpopular opinion wise. Can I go first? I, I got I got I got one to piss off two of the people in this call. No, oh, I know this one. I know Cats fucking. Overrated. Nope, he's not. He's literally he's underrated. Anyway. Wait, who? Wait, what did he say? Cats. He said cats, cats overrated. overrated. 
that no. Nah. For the way he rated, not. wait, how is he overrated? Yeah, because he's, he's under, the way he's he all under. Is he literally he's one under of the most disrespected players in fact. the league? That's that. He's one of the most disrespected. I swear to God, it's for just no like reason. Russell Westbrook. For no he's reason, disrespected as hell. I don't the know. Way he's y'all overrated. Him, um, um, the way y'all y'all suck him off is he should be bringing y'all at least one championship. He hasn't that's done not at all how I talk about Cat. I don't think he can bring us to two. The fuck? Yeah. We need more yeah. people. But the way you make him sound like. Well, Matt, you have this you conversation like, with me. You act like he's. You make it sound like, like he can every- carry a team. He can't carry a team. When the fuck did I say you could carry a team? Robinson? You probably could. He needs. It's kind of like okay when you look at Jokic or Embiid, they have a Jokic good supporting a cast around them. Type of player. They have good teams. They Jokic has Jamal Murray. He has Will Barton, Paul Millsap, Embiid. I know he you has did not just ben name. Simmons. I know you did not just name Will Barton and Paul Millsap as his as his. Hey, they're hey, good Matt, role oh, 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 They're oh, good players. Paul Millsap and Paul Millsap and Will Barton. Shut down. No, oh, I got that. Role they're good. They're, they're, good, good, role they're, they're good role players. They they play their role the correct way. They play defense, hit shots. Thank you, oh, man. Especially they're, they're good role players. players. And you're right. Notice how you said defenders, right? When has Cat ever had defenders on his team, or outside of Jimmy uh, Butler and Robert Covington? I mean, Joshua Kogi. No one. Joshua. Okay, yeah, Joshua Kogi, but we don't really use like. Yeah, he just facts. Needs... Joshua Kogi. Okay, this is my unpopular opinion. He's a future defensive player of the year. Ooh. Very Ooh. potentially he could be. I agree. I, I don't know, bro. <laughs> I, I don't Ooh, D boy? Josh Okoki? That that's that's a, that's not a stretch, but like That's a stretch. That's not a stretch. <laughs> Bro, it is hard to win defensive player of the year as a guard. Or, yeah, it's hard to win as a four, unless you're Jonathan Isaac. Jonathan Isaac has DPOY potential. Because he's a forward. He's six. Uh, no, but he, he can play either forward, though. Josh Okoge cannot. Like, what I'm man, saying is hard to win as a guard, Jakai. <laughs> Josh Okoge is a pure I look, I look at though. I'm going to Josh Okoge at the four. Jonathan Isaac can guard the one to one. Jonathan Isaac can not guard, Jakai. He's a <laughs> fucking <laughs> forward, you idiot. He play my small forward. <laughs> look, look, look. I look at, bro, for some reason, I always look at Josh as a forward. I do not know why. He, I always look at him as a forward. But. Guard. It's a stretch. It's not a stretch. In my opinion, it's not a stretch. Yeah, it's not a stretch, but he I don't know where he's going with the four. Shit. He cannot guard the four. Yeah. Let's put I Anthony mean, Davis on Josh Nikogi, see who wins that matchup. Like, yeah. I, bro, usually defensive player of the years, they can guard all five positions. Mm-hmm. True. Gary Which I, I mean, don't know how the Kobe fuck. Guard the four, though. Rudy Gobert has won two. Here, here's my unpopular opinion. Rudy Gobert is not that good of a defender. Uh, that's the thing, though. He's low post defender. Perimeter, he can't guard perimeter. He can't it, move at all. He's, he's, he's not. He's not as like mobile as like. Exactly. Yo, yo, and it has a seizure every time he gets crossed. Facts. You saw him against Curry, bro. That man went in circles, bro. <laughs> Well, yeah, okay, but that's that's in fairness, that's unfair. You have one of the quickest point guards. Okay, true, but if you're a defensive player of the year, you have to like I don't know. I just don't. Yeah, I just feel like he's overrated on defense. I, yeah, I he's agree. A good I'm just saying that that example is kind of unfucking fair. I mean, he even hey, he hey, has hey, Chris hey, Paul. Hey, he had Chris Paul looking like an idiot, and I mean Chris Paul. All right, I'm, I'm gonna bring up. If the you look at that clip, Chris Paul stepped on his foot. So I mean, I don't know. Uh, Chris Paul stepped on Curry's foot. Damn, I can't bro. That's whatever. <laughs> but I'm gonna bring up the music unpopular opinion. Nicki Minaj is ass. Oi! That's not even unpopular. Nicki is ass. She is so bad, dude. Swear to God. Not good. I, I wanna say this. If it comes out she has plastic, I'm guaranteeing you she's falling off. Bro. If there's anything about her body that's plastic, she's bro. falling off. Bro, she's full of plastic. Nigga, she, well, we know she's full of plastic. <laughs> I know, I'm <laughs> saying if there's any proof. Bro, I don't understand how motherfuckers can listen to Nicki Minaj for more than two hours. 
I literally can't really, more than dude, two I can't seconds. Even to a song. I can't listen to a song, bro. Especially their stance too. They got some of the worst stands. Oh my like, dude, dude. Nicki Minaj's stands. All right, so look, my ex, she used to fuck with Nicki Minaj heavy, right? Mm -hmm. Until I played the Sheether diss track where Remy Ra accident like bodied her, nigga. Just, 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 just fucking put her in the trash, wrapped her ass up, and slunk her in the river multiple fucking times on a track. <laughs> this bitch was like, wow. Nicki Minaj is still better than her. <laughs> He's not better than Remy Ma. She's not better than. Bro, that bro, Lil Kim is better than Nicki Minaj. Lauren Hill is better than Nicki Minaj. Oh, facts, nigga. Do you think? Here's a question: Megan Thee Stallion or Nicki Minaj? Meg. Ooh, ooh, ooh! I'll Meg. answer that. Meg. Neither. Nah, Meg, Meg, no, Meg has flow. Megan. Megan. Meg has flow. Right? I hate both of them, dude. Meg, Meg can rap. Meg can rap, but like, bro, literally, like, whole. Oh, yeah, you know my real opinion. Meg Thee Stallion is ass too. <laughs> exactly, Thank you, you, bro. You saw the amount of awards she won. Yeah, rapper of the year for Savage, dude. Savage is so annoying. Shut up! If I see that shit on my fuck you page one more time, I'm going crazy. I'm tired of it. I swear to God, bro. I mean, I mean, fuck. I mean, while we're on the topic of bad female rappers, Cardi B is another one of those. I, I, I can't stand her either. I, look, her old voice school, just pissed me off. Wait, old school female rappers were way better. Oh, God. Exactly. Monica, Tamia, Lil Kim, bro, Queen Latifah, all of them are better all than... All of them! Queen, Lat oh, yeah. Queen Latifah was lyrically body! Facts. Any of these bitches out here. That's facts. All right, but here's another music unpopular thing. Uh, <laughs> Sean okay. Mendez's ass. Uh, oh, I, mean, I can see it. Niggas don't really listen to him. <clears throat> I'll listen to that nigga. Ashley, if you're watching this, he's ass. He's not <laughs> good. I mean, I, I can see that. Sean I don't, Mendez I don't think he's is good, just good. I don't like necessarily hate him. He's Sean tall, Mendez he's is powerful. just. Sean Mendez is literally just Nick Jonas. Yeah, you're not wrong on that one. No cap. Okay, the only difference is his hair goes this way as opposed to this way. That's the only All right, one. now I got, I got another one. All right. The baby is not a good rapper. The He's okay, awesome. yeah. Oh, I don't I, like I, the baby because he you, has the how same can you be flow. A good rapper if you song. only have one flow. That's what I just said. He has the same flow. Yeah. All like it, it's so un I can't. Oh my god. I mean they got the job done. I mean it's got him somewhere, but I mean, I mean making a million. I mean I mean I mean because he started he was, he was like hi, you know, his baby niggas was like, okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, and then, and it was like ha, 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 ha. <laughs> like niggas, shut up. Switch it up. Sing. Do something. <laughs> All right, do y'all have any? Uh, I, I know y'all got some. Okay, okay. I yeah. got one. Oh, you, you want to go ahead? I mean, yeah. Uh, All right, so my thing is, I don't think Andrew Wiggins will thrive in the Warriors system as much as people think he will. That's not impossible. And Zach, I know I'm, me and I'm not getting into argument again, bro. I'm not getting into argument again. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, okay, this I, is what I was trying to say. And this, there's people who agree with me. Wiggins. In Golden State, there's a way different culture, way different situation than there was in Minnesota. We turned him into a shooter when he's not a shooter. That's why he didn't thrive as much as he got like older. You saw in his first couple years, he was using his athleticism. People compared him to the next Kobe. And then people were like, oh, he's not living up to his potential. Ever since he got that contract, he's been ass. Jimmy Butler killed him. It wasn't Jimmy Butler or the contract or nothing. We developed him wrong. We turned him into a shooter when he's not a shooter. But here's the thing, He's though. Not a Golden State shooter. is a shooting system as well. Exactly, they but the thing about the spacing they got, they have Kelly Oubre now. They got uh, they got Curry. He's healthy now. Like, mm -hmm. I mean, he might be able to shoot. Like, they're probably gonna have him shoot threes, obviously, because I mean that's how you do it in this era, like we talked about before with the Michael Jordan thing. But like, 
he I believe that with that spacing that they got now, because we didn't have shooters. We never had shooters. The only thing we really had was Cat. And Cat being your best shooter is not that's not a good thing. A center being your best shooter, that's just not gonna work. The spacing was just awful in Minnesota. Okay. Him and him and Golden State, that's just a completely different situation. I, I agree with Zach on on that take, because it's Golden State is a championship level team. They're not gonna do some dumb shit where they force a player to be a player he can't be. Mm-hmm. Yes, they're gonna have him shoot sometimes. Exactly. Because if you look at many of their players, they still shoot or sit on the three-point line. They're, he's not going to shoot as much as he did in Minnesota, but he's going to still shoot, but he won't, he'll do it to his ability, and Golden State will find that for him and help him. Because, I mean, Curry was a... In college, he was, he was starting to build up, you know, and then he goes to Golden State, and it's... Honestly, for me, it's he came out of nowhere. Curry did. I mean, he was sufficient in college. I mean, not to the level he we see him today. I guess. Oh. Yeah. Curry was a he was he was known as a shot chucker at Davidson. Like forced off a lot of threes. Bro, Curry, Curry, Curry was like literally Davidson's god. I mean, he, he mm-hmm. took them to he took them to the tournament. Yeah, like it's good. Elite A type shit. Yeah, bro, that was Davis's first time, right? I think so. Yeah, I think so I believe so. Curry, Curry was a guy. LeBron was coming to watch yeah. Curry in college, bro. Uh, but yeah, speaking on the Andrew Wiggins stuff, I'm not saying he's gonna be a bad player, but like, I don't think he's Shoot. gonna live up to what people think he is because people think he's gonna give you good defense. I, I think. I think all right, I'm gonna say this. I think Andrew Wiggins got a lot of time, bro. Yeah. He, he's, he's still young. He, what is this sixth season? He, uh, seventh. 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 I, I, yeah, he, but yeah. Yeah, you you start to hit your prime in like your eighth or ninth season. So I think, I personally, I think Andrew Weeks is gonna have a breakout year. That's what I was trying I, to say. I, yeah. Especially on a team like that where there's so many options, it gives him that space to have. Because the defense isn't gonna be as primarily focused on him as they will be on like Curry or even hell. Uber. I mean, I think unpopular opinion. I think Golden State could make it to the finals. Could what? Weren't you just arguing that, that they weren't unpopular opinion, Tyler? I I I, I know that. <laughs> weren't you just arguing finals. that they are weak? Okay, about how they, has a it, look, year. think about it. Let me talk. I bitch. And if Andrew Wiggins has a breakout year, Kelly Uber also has a breakout year. Eric Pascal gets a year better. Is Jordan Poole still on the Warriors? Am I right? Yeah, I believe. So. Yeah, he he's is. gonna get a year better as a shooter. Draymond Green yeah, goes back to his old self, and James Wiseman lives up to those expectations. That's six players that Curry has gotten that are now better. That, that's a that's that's a that's a rotation. But there's still Plus Curry. Hey, that's just a good lineup, bro. They're still young, though. Yeah, but, but if they live up to expectations, I mean, look at Tyler Harrow. Mm-hmm. Oh, I mean, was a rookie. He was a god. But they have solid veterans, though. They, he has solid veterans. Mm-hmm. All right, another unpopular opinion. Y'all, y'all already know how much I love Zach Levine. So, uh... <clears throat> hey man, we all do. Man. He's a top five shooting guard in the league. That, thank, uh, I, I approve. I approve. I can, yeah, yeah. 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 I'd go as far as to say he's a top three. No. Not top three. <laughs> Stop it. No. He could be later I, on. I I, no. I I think I think he's a top three. I it's who is who wait, wait who's you say top, top five? I think he's just on that border of top three. I it's he's on the board. All right, who, who's y'all's top five shooting guards? <clears throat> Harden should be Harden. Yeah. Harden's yeah. Harden. one. Um are we I mean, gonna count Clay? Demi Butler shooting guard. He's small forward. He's small forward. Because right, shooting guard is small forward. Bradley Beal at two. I'm sorry. You said what? Yeah. Bradley Beal at two. Mm-hmm. I, I can rock with that. He's got to be, but no, after the the book, one, Devin Booker. Devin Booker. Oh, Devin Booker. Yeah, that's hard to never mind. Yeah. 
Yeah, I got Debo Thompson getting three. <clears throat> Clay Thompson, if we consider him healthy. Clay Thompson at four and Zach at five. Zach yeah. at five. Yeah. yeah. I, that sounds reasonable. Jalen Brown, too. Jalen Brown isn't as good as Zach Levine. I'm a Celtic I think fan, Zach and Levine. I will I, that in a as, as much as I love Jalen Brown and how underrated he is, I think he's. I think Zach Levine's better. I think Zach. Levine. I feel like if Zach Levine had a better team, bro, he get. Dude, he would be it. Like, you know the Dallas Mavericks rumors, bro. Imagine oh, him God, on the I Mavericks, bro. Go to Dallas so bad. Levine, I think, Luka. I think Zach has. I think Zach can be better than Clay ever was. Oh yeah, for sure. For sure. I mean, he can he can shoot pretty well. He can shoot. And the thing is, I mean, he did hit thirteen. He's not just a game. shooter. He's not just yeah, a he shooter. He had a game winner in that game too, bro. People are saying he's not he's he's not just a dunker. I mean, he was in the three point contest. He hit thirty threes in the game. He had forty nine in that game. I mean, at the beginning of this year, he was averaging what thirty points a game on, yeah. on like a, a seven game. I mean, he was killing. Something like that. Yeah, bro, he was hard. But I have another unpopular opinion. Football edition. Okay, okay. In two to three years, DK Metcalf will be the best receiver in the league. Fuck a bit. No. Yes. Yes. What? Do, yes. do you think he's going to be better than Julio and Hopkins? I think so. Hell, I think so. fuck. I, no. 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 I don't Hopkins. know. You forget. DK is a good player. I do not. Don't think I'm hating on DK. In any way. I, he's a great player. Let's look at Washington. Terry McLaurin has shit quarterbacks. And that's exactly still why he's not in that well. conversation, Matt. What? The reason why he's not in that conversation yet, that, that I'm putting DK in, is because he has a shit quarterback. If he had better exactly. quarterbacks, I'd be... Yeah. Listen, listen, if he can listen, get a good quarterback... Listen. If he had better quarterbacks, I'd be saying he's better than DK. But he doesn't. He DK has Russell West. Yeah, right. Russell yeah, West. That's my that. point. That's right, that doesn't make him. <laughs> if you, bro, you know <laughs> quarterback affects receivers, nigga. Yes, oh, Tom Brady you know made, that, right? Like, the receivers just don't take the ball out the fucking center's hands and run, right? <laughs> you only have to catch the ball with the quarterback, right? Yes, I get that. You then you how is he a top right? receiver? Then how is he a top receiver? I said soon to be because he has a top quarterback. But what is he? Like, make good if the quarterback, is that, if he's the best target with a quarterback like that, he is going to be a top receiver soon. Okay, I'm gonna just say this: if Devontae Adams didn't have Aaron Rodgers, I feel like people wouldn't even consider him top five. Yeah, the quarterback. That's that's the, that it's the quarterback. So no, D Hop. Look, 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 look. D Hop and Julio are just different. They're different. Yeah, they're, they're just different. Breed. They're just different breeds. But I think DK is about to enter that category. I mean, because D Hop and Julio, they're just physical specimens, bro. Like they, they just go up and get it, nigga. They don't <laughs> no matter who. They're, they're like, different, bro. They're, they're, I think right now D Hop and Julio, it's like one A and one B. I, I, I can't. No, I, I give Hop edge. Yeah. I, bro, personally, I give D Hop edge, but I can see D Hop being better than. Him. Speaking yeah, of the top, I have I have an unpopular opinion. Mm-hmm. I think Deshaun Watson is better than Lamar Jackson and will be better than he can ever be. I, I mean, Matt kind of has a point in a sense. Okay, if Deshaun can get a better fucking team like receivers, yes. Jesus Christ, yeah. He, last that year they no couldn't. Money. They had a mediocre team, and they still ended up in the playoffs. I mean, yeah. I'm a Clemson fan. I'm a Clemson fan, so I may be a little biased. But the things he's doing, his pocket presence, his his ability to throw it long, his ability to escape the pocket when the pocket collapses, he's him and Patrick Mahomes are gonna be the Tom Brady and Joe Montana. Tom what? That level of good. Patrick Mahomes, we know, is gonna be amazing. I think Deshaun's up there with him. That's no, so no, this. This is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking like, you, like you even did. Uh, Watson's no one. Like, he cooks right, right. Well, you you glitched out. Oh, you're lagging your ass off. <laughs> 
Yeah. My, my bad. You did not just say. You think Brandon Tom Cooks Watson is Watson's Watson Watson best receiver, Watson. right? Brady, Joe Montana, and Patrick Mahomes. Yes. He's in a shit team, and he's still putting up numbers. Yeah. If he gets a team, team. Okay, let me, let me rephrase that. If either the Texans build around him or he gets out of Houston, then he can be that. He has the potential to be one of the best. But Definitely. will he? I don't know if we will. Because of the contract he just signed, it's going to be hard for... I mean, if you got a potential like that, the many teams are going to sign you, but are willing to sign you. But I don't know. Houston needs to do something and do something soon. Soon, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, time is... I'm glad they fired Bill O'Brien because that trade to get rid of DeAndre That's, Hopkins was, was the fucking stupidest terrible. fucking thing that was I've retarded. ever seen in sports history. Honestly, in, in probably sports history, I've seen. I, mm-hmm. That was retarded. I have a popular opinion. The Mellow Ball in four to five years would be a top five player. Uh, I think he needs to get yes, a point guard. That's not... I think he needs to get out of Charlotte for that to happen. I don't think he's gonna be top five. If his defense gets up there, then yeah, yeah, that's yeah, and if, if, he can, if he can if he can improve his defense. Shooting, um, but think, yeah. but think about it. As quick as he is, he's six eight. He's an elite ass playmaker. On NBA guards that are like six three and six two. He just, I mean, he was playing against grown men. I can see it. I can see it. He are, he's already played professionally overseas. He can easily develop over in the NBA, 100. I could I could see him being top five. I don't know about bad. I gotta see him like I don't know. I just gotta see him play like a fucking game first. Top All right, five. Jakai, did, didn't you have an unpopular opinion? Yeah. Shit, I forgot. Oh, right, right, right. All right, so this is music. Okay. Yeah. Doesn't know how much I love Brent. To the bottom of my fucking heart. The only I'll say this: the only reason why, look, he is popular for like the mainstream music. So like Dead Man Walking, Trust, all of that shit. But he doesn't get more recognition just because of those fucking songs, which I believe in. Wait, Jakai, who are you talking about? Brent Fires. Right. right. Give you better. No, 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 me is not. No, he is not. I say, yo, he knows no, no, better. That nigga, bro. Bro, yes, he is. He is not, bro. Bro, you gotta listen to more, Brent. I am sorry, bro. Bro, I listen. Jakai, no, Jakai, no, Jakai, why is why is he better than Gibbons? He's better than Gibbons, nigga. Cause nigga, they, y'all don't understand. People be listening to his mainstream shit. He, it's more than that. If you listen to any of his albums, it's. I just what are what what are in those albums that makes him better than Gibeon? You, you're talking about the albums, but you're not giving the examples. I fucking um, what's that one song? Shit. Um, first. If he one, was better, if he's better, then you should be able to name it like this. But, but shut the fuck up. First world <laughs> problem. Fight so hard. <laughs> Fucking um, insecure, niggas know insecure, and um, I, I just feel like Gibeon when he when he like writes and when he is actually like singing, you relate way more to him. He's more he's a more relatable artist. His voice sounds better. His voice is unique. Brent is drop the roof and let the smoke clear. I got done dancing, dancing, riding. Sometimes I wish you knew. Ooh. bro, that shit sounds so much better, bro. I mean, give on. He just his production's better. His yeah. voice is like more smooth, more soft. Give on sounds like a slowed down version of any song that you ever hear. That's how I see Give And people like it. No, uh, <laughs> <weird>. <laughs> oh, all right, all right, all right, all right. I got this on public opinion. Giannis is not a top five player. I, I, and I, he's better than Giannis. I agree. I agree. Yeah. And I feel like, and I feel like this. Minnesota niggas, y'all go love me for this. If you switch Cat and Giannis, Cat would be better than Giannis is. Probably. Uh, yeah. yeah. Honestly, I mean, Cat can stretch the floor like Giannis can't. I mean, I think the reason that Giannis got so much hype is because of his transition from the league. He started off as a twig, and mate. Yeah. 
I think that's why there's so much hype around him. Is he a top player in the league? Yes. Is he a top five? Hell no. When I think about top five, I think about people that have made it to the finals. Giannis True. has not seen the finals appearance in his career. True. I'm thinking True. of the LeBrons, the KDs, the Stephen Currys. James Harden made it to the finals. The Kawhis. I mean... Yeah. Uh, it's going to be somebody else. He could, he could become a top five. Is he currently? No. I want to see him get to the finals first. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Is <sighs> all right. Another. Unpopular... I, I feel like this year's a make it. Like he has this year's a prove it season for him because he has the pieces around him this year. I, I got I got two unpopular opinions in one. Dame is overrated, and Kyrie is the top three point guard. And I think and I is. think and I think Kyrie is better than Dame. Mm. I, if Kyrie can say healthy isn't thought. such a I fucking cancer, if Kyrie isn't such a fucking cancer and he can stay healthy, sure. But Dame, I'm, like, I'm trying to think from a non-biased opinion, because you know I obviously hate Kyrie. I mean, that's just <laughs> Boston fan. I hate. I mean, but it's <laughs> take a step back and it's. Before LeBron got there, he in his earliest earlier of his career, he looked like he could be. It's ti- his time in Boston. His, I mean, we haven't seen him healthy in a while, which can limit that. But it's he's gotten the label of a team cancer for a reason. I mean, the comments he said. It's oh, Kyrie, for him to be, people hate on Kyrie for no reason. I mean, Kyrie's a good guy. He's yeah. Don't get give... yeah, but in the locker room, that's just different. He's good, but yeah, locker room, dude. I don't think he's better than Dame. I it's. Mm-hmm. I think it goes, the top two. Dame, and then Kyrie. I don't okay, think. I it, wanna, wait, what about, about the, Curry? I said the top two. I don't know who you want to say, but I'm just saying. Wherever you it's put Curry, to me is Curry, Kyrie, Dame. I think then it's Curry, Dame, Kyrie. Yeah, uh, you said you had you said you had an opinion. Wait, what? Well, this one is about a team. And speaking of Boston, speaking of Kyrie. Uh-oh. Again, I'm a Boston fan, so this is gonna be biased. But I think cause so for the Lakers. Y'all had last year, you had JaVale McGee, Dwight Howard, and AD. That gave y'all's front court depth. Y'all just lost two of those players. Yes, AD is good. But what happens when he comes off comes off the court? Montrez Harrell. Montrez Harrell. They got an upgrade. What do you think of them though? <laughs> I forgot all about Hell. This bro said, "Hold, you lost Javale McGee and Dwight Howard. Like, bro, literally. bro, they got an upgrade. They got hell, yeah. a six man uh, of the year. Never mind. I think <laughs> that, that I still- think though next year the finals are gonna be Boston and LA. Uh, I don't like, know about you Boston. Think, all right, you, all right, you think guys, Boston? we got one minute left. Uh, hey, 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 I got one. The Wizards are gonna be a top five seed. Fuck no! Yeah. Hell no! Uh, no! Yeah. no. no. Bro. No! Yes. No! 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 no. Hell no! You don't think so? You don't no. Give me no. Give me no. Give me no. Give me your top right piece now. right now. Give me your top piece. All right, Lilith. You got the Nets. Milwaukee. Sixers. Miami. You got the Bucks. You got the fucking uh. Pa- I, I got the Pacers. Hey, over there, hell no. Pacers? No. The Hawks? No. No. Pacers are better. Yes. 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 No, bro. Atlanta. No. The Knicks are better than the Wizards. What do you say? <laughs> the Knicks are better than the Wizards this year. Uh, Matt, shut the fuck up. I don't up, know about please. the Knicks. Shut the fuck up. Okay. Beach. Fuck now. Don't call All them. right. We had a slight intermission, but continue. All right. Yeah, 
first of all, the Knicks are a fucking dumpster fire. Second of all, I really look the way the Pacers are looking about the Ola Depot situation and shit like that. That's what I'm saying. Like, and plus with Miles Turner too, Ola Depot, and Miles Turner. I just think that the Wizards are better, nigga. I just think the Wizards are better than the Pacers, and it might sound like. Can you hold something for me? Can you hold something for me? Bro, bro, okay, okay, okay. We got all right. You said top five, right? Yes. There's Miami. Yes. There's Milwaukee. Yes. There's Toronto. Yes. There's Boston. Mm -hmm. There's Brooklyn. Mm -hmm. Then there's Orlando. I forgot. Fuck you don't, no, no, no. Stop <laughs> at five. Stop Indiana. at five. No, no, no. Stop at five. He said they're a top five team. You want to tell me that Washington is Nigga, I'm trying to prove they're not making the playoffs. They're making the playoffs, bro. They're making no. the playoffs. They're making the playoffs. No, no, no. They're making the playoffs. Atlanta. The playoffs. Atlanta the now. Hell Atlanta no, they're not making the playoffs. Making the playoffs over Orlando. They're making the playoffs over Orlando. No, I don't think they're, they're better not. than Detroit. Yes, they are. I don't think they're better than New York. I don't know. I no. I, I'm yeah, I'm gonna yeah. disagree with that one. What? I think they're better than Detroit and New York. New York Bro, got rid of Todd. When Blake Griffin they actually has a healthy season, that costed them a shit. And Derrick Rose, and they just got Jeremy Grant. Nigga. And Killian. And then they just got who who, who, who did they get in the draft? Who, who, Killian who, who, Hayes. Who, who, Killian Hayes. Hayes. Bro, that, that's a good team. Wizards are not a playoff team. They okay. suck. Okay. They fucking okay. suck. Jakai, let's let's talk to Jakai real quick. Let's talk to Jakai real quick. Alright, what's up? Okay, I get you I get you where you're coming from. Bradley Beal is Bradley Beal. Yeah. He's gonna drop 20. Yeah. You're, you're possibly barring injury again, knowing John Wall. You're adding John Wall. Mm -hmm. Who is now coming off of Achilles? And what was his other injury? Uh, something to his knee or something? Yes, yeah, nothing to his knee. That's two injuries that affect a player's career. I know, but nigga, you clearly don't, you because you think that's gonna lead them. No, 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 Jukai. Okay, let's take away John Wall for a second. Denny, Denny, he's a he's a rookie. I know he's a he rookie. Had Hachimura, he's a second year player. He's going to get better. <laughs> Those are three players, Jakai. Those are three hey, players. Um, Name Brian, someone we, else who's going to give you that David top five seed. He's a fucking sniper, my nigga. We're making the fucking but playoffs. But he's not. Y'all are not making the fucking team. playoffs. Over nigga. No. Bro, yeah, I right, look. I, I, I'm going to tell, tell you, 18 better than the fucking Wizards right now. Yeah, you, think our, you really think our Lions will make the playoffs? You think our Lions will make the playoffs? Chica, Chica. They have a better chance than the fucking Wizards? No, bro. Listen, listen, listen. Milwaukee, Toronto, yes. Boston, Miami, Philly, Brooklyn, Atlanta, yeah. Indiana. They're and then Orlando. Than They're better than Indiana. I am fucking sorry. No! No! Hell no! 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 PJ Warren? PJ Warren? Indiana is tough. They're, no, bro. Charlotte, oh. Charlotte is better than Washington. They're, Charlotte is better than the Wizards. They're Charlotte's top, better. Top, yeah. Charlotte, Charlotte is better than the Wizards. They just, oh, they're, hey. They're, in my my opinion, I'm taking Chicago over Washington. Please shut the door. Facts. 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 Wizards are ass. <laughs> Wizards are ass. The Wizards are ass. They're not. They're not. <laughs> they're not. <laughs> the Wizards are ass, bro. Bro, no. y'all are not going anywhere. Nigga, shut up. Hey, you know where y'all going? Where? Home. Back to the lottery, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck out of here, yo. <laughs> y'all not going nowhere, nigga. Oh, what the okay. fuck? Y'all are going to your couches. You might as well get your <laughs> shit bags. <laughs> I hey, hey, matter of fact, hey, 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 I'm, I'm going to show you guys what fucking John Wall was doing last year. <laughs> oh, no. God. Oh, hey. God. <laughs> Where is it at? Where the fuck is it at? <laughs> Bro, y'all just <laughs> badly hey, do it. Hey, I know you're his bag of chips, sitting on his fucking sofa, watching the playoffs, nigga. He was not doing shit. He eating his chips, nigga. He was probably having a party with Bradley Bill. Hey, bro. Hey, John Wall 2019-2020 highlights. <laughs> <laughs> this is so disrespectful. We're making it. Yeah, I got an unpopular opinion, though. The Hawks can be the number four seed. They can be a top four. I agree with that. I agree with that. No, yeah, Tyler. Tyler, you added two veteran guards 
No, that I get that. Defensively solid. We call it a the- draft. John Collins is gonna get better. Trey Young is gonna get better. Rondo, we got Hunter, Winter. Bro, I got another unpopular opinion. I'm Get not ready. saying they're not gonna hey. make it, but I think they're borderline top four. I don't think they are top four. I got another unpopular opinion. Cam Reddish is a soon to be superstar. Cam Reddish? Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, uh. Superstar? Super, yes. Cam Reddish. Wait, is wait, wait. Off. So you're you're talking like Dame, Dame Lillard type superstar? Nigga, when I say superstar, I'm, I'm, I'm saying like, like he's gonna be. I think he's like all like a perennial all. When you say soon, when you say soon, how soon are you talking? Four to five years. Okay, that's reasonable. That's reasonable. He's tough. Cam Reddish is on underrated. I like Cam. Yes, I like he Cam. is. Yeah. But to say that at this point, with what we've seen from him, it's you would think. Look, let's, no, no, no. let's let's take at something. Let's look at Andrew Wiggins coming out of. We were comparing him to the next Kobe, like you guys were saying. Yeah. What is he now? Is he a superstar? Is he that? Next he's just Kobe? he's just a normal role player that someone could use. That's what you that's, look. That's, that's what you see what when I'm you look saying. at Wiggins. It's, in four to five years, we don't know what he's gonna do. He could get well, no depends on. He could when you look at Wiggins, it was just because of how he was developed. It was just because of how he's developed. But when you look at Cam, if they use him right. When Ryan said that's that that's reasonable, but it all depends on if they use him like how he's supposed like how he's supposed to play. Exactly. We used Wiggins wrong. That's why I say he's better in Golden State. Anybody got any music unpopular opinions? I- I'd like to hear them. Ooh, um, JID is underrated. What do you say? JID is underrated. It's not really an unpopular opinion. That's just a fact. Yeah, but. but. Uh, young Drake boy is overrated. Hydrated. Drake is overrated. Young boy is, it, young boy is overrated. Young, young, boy is, yeah, young boy is overrated. And it's not, no, no, I'm not gonna cap. Young boy makes some good music. Yeah, it's, young boy makes good music. It's just his fan base. Like, mine. I don't even know. No, no, no. Jaka, I think it's, he releases so much music that it's like drowning out his good music. <laughs> nah, 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 if you want to be good, good. It's, it's good music. It's his fan base. I swear to you, bro. Oh, it's, no, it's, 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 young it's, boy it's, it's, to go. Crazy, young boy number. Young boy on top. Cocaine train. Man, oh. shut the fuck <laughs> up. Young boy, bro. I swear. They're toxic. They're like Boston fans and Philly fans. No disrespect, man. You niggas are toxic as fuck. Yeah, oh, but, I know. I, 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 I know. I know. <laughs> All right, young boy fans are toxic, bro. Oh my god. Ugh. Austin fans. Ugh. Oh yeah, and Tribe is better than Wu Tang. Wow, <laughs> Tribe is better than Wu Tang. <laughs> no, they're not. Nigga, no, Wu-Tang well, is better. Well, guys, I think we see from last episode, Jakai's taste in anything sucks ass. <laughs> no. In this episode, last episode, we saw that he doesn't like mac and cheese. This episode, we think, we see that he thinks the Wizards are a top eight team in the East. And now we see that he thinks the Tribe is better than Wu-Tang. I rest my case. Bro, Wu Tang said it, bro. Come on, man. Uh, yes. Bro, bro, no. Everybody it's in Wu Tang is. Bro, anybody in Wu Tang could go solo right now and be a top 50 rapper of all time. Facts. Not everybody Over in Tribe could do that. I mean, I'm not like. That's facts, but at the same time, a Tribe's still, still pretty good. It's yeah, not like. I know. Good. I love them. But they're not better than Wu Tang. I I agree with that. What? Is this nigga Jakai frozen? <laughs> he's lagging. He, he's Difficult doing trip. the robot. Watchers, That's listeners, that. this nigga is lagging. <laughs> Any more unpopular opinions? I have one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Matt, I have one. Matt, I'm we trying to find a We saw your story dude. today. Wait, what? I'm trying to find it. Can do you know where it is? Uh, a good opinion from uh, Jakai? Yeah, I can't find that either. I, bro, I can't find it. I can't, I can't. All right, can't Matt, 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 come on, come on. What do you guys say? Uh, like you said on your story today on Snapchat, Loop, I'm not going to even try to pronounce his last name because I'm going to butcher the fuck out of it. Lupe Fiasco. 
he is underrated as fuck. I don't even know who it is. I'm gonna stay out of this one. He, he's been underrated. I, he, he's a better he's a better lyricist than Kendrick Lamar. He's a better lyricist than Kanye. He's a better lyricist than Jay. I mean, Lupe Fiasco. I think probably, he's probably. Oh, top. Lupe Fiasco. Yeah. If oh, he yeah, had a. I thought you said someone completely different. I was like, the fuck? If he had as much recognition as a quarter of Kendrick or J. Cole had, he'd be better than them. Ah! No! No! If, because if you said, no, you said that he's lyrics, he's lyrically better than them. Lyrically, that is one element of rap. Yeah, but it's if he can get that recognition. Nigga, Eminem is lyrically better than some of the niggas that are better than him. Yeah, he's Eminem is lyrically better than Jay Z, but Jay Z is better than Eminem. I, I, I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> Ooh, actually, I got one. All right. Kid Leroy is already starting to fall off. That's what? A no! Hell no! Hell no! Hell no! Fuck no! No! No, Ryan. No, Ryan. I don't want to hear anything from you. You are a Kid Leroy stan. No, I'm not! Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Bro, he just put out a good out. album. Did you not hear his new song? What? So done, bro. That's just. I, I'm, not say, I'm not saying he is. I'm just saying, coming from the line. falling off, but he's only getting better. Hey. Mm. Bro, what? I think he started off amazing, and then now he's. I don't know. I don't really like him anymore. <sighs> I, I think he's getting better, but he's, think, it's, yeah, it's, it's not like he's. Pro- look, 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 look. It's not like he's progressing like this. He's progressing more like like like. He's slowly getting better. He's, he's slowly like, going he's out. Rocking. I will admit that. He's not like getting like. He's kind of plateauing. Bro, he's only right, what, he's 17 or 18. Bro, he's yeah. 16. He's that young, and you want to say he's falling off? And you want to comment about Jakai's unpopular opinion? <laughs> I know, I, I know, okay. I know I'm not one to talk. But come on now, Tyler. You're telling me he's 16, 18 17. year old. He's two years older than you. And you want to tell me he's already falling off. In a sense, yeah. Man's not even 18 yet. That man's like 16, 17. What? How is he falling off? I want to know what kind of narcotics they sell up in Minnesota. Because you are on that good. Oh, point. they got some good shit. <laughs> 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 it's Tyler, you, Tyler must be on some because that, that I, I, is... I'm, I'm loving these music of popular opinions. Y'all hit me. No, <laughs> it's silent, bro. <laughs> yeah, y'all, y'all I'm dead after he said Leroy's falling off. I don't know. I, I wish, no, I wish I heard, one of I y'all niggas Zach... would. I would, hey, hey, yo, I wish one of y'all niggas would call Kendrick overrated. I swear to God, I kick you on. Oh, overrated. He's fucking goaded. Wait, who? What'd you say? Kendrick's fucking goaded. Yeah. Right. Kendrick's fucking goaded. What the? I, I need him to drop something. I heard Zach say something earlier that I want to come back to. He said that Drake is overrated. He is. He is. He is. Okay. Bro, I should, bro okay. let me tell you. Let me tell y'all a story. So, my ex, right? Why'd you have to shift the camera? I mean, <laughs> shut the fuck I, up and let, let me tell you a story real quick. I, I knocked my computer, bro. Shut up. Look, my ex, right? She ain't trying to sit here and argue with me that Drake is a is the best artist of all time. Just because what he did in the in the 2010s. I mean, I, artist, that's debatable, though. I know, but like, he's not, though. He's overrated. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no. I, if this look, man dropped the two C slide, bro, that shit was garbage, and people broke. Uh, uh, all right, look, 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 look. Best artist of all time. That's actually like a good debate because Drake has not, to me, Drake. Yeah, he, has not he hasn't fallen off. I'm not gonna lie. Drake he has, has never put out a bad project, and he's a hit maker. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's never fallen off. He always. Drake, Drake is. He probably has a song in the top 100 right now. 
Uh, la laugh now and cry later. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That shit is tough though. Yeah. When you like listen, like that came out merely months ago and it's already like one of those songs when you think of Drake, you think of that kind of song kind of. Yeah. I mean, at least for but me, this is probably on I think but I didn't know of Little Dirk before that song and then after it, I think that like, that just, I don't know what I'm trying to say here, but it's, I didn't know of, and then that future, it's, uh, I'm taking it, I said something stupid. You better, <laughs> you better not finish that sentence, Matt. The moment finish you said future, what? I was like, hold on. Feature, I'm. Dekio Shrekio! What? You didn't know who Dirk was? That's tough. Hey, hey, that's the local white boy, man. <laughs> On God. But look, I think Drake is definitely overrated as a rapper. But as yeah. an artist, he's correctly like, as an artist, he's probably one of the greatest of all time, if not the greatest. Yeah. As an artist. I, I can get But as a rapper, that. he's not top 10, he's not top 20. Thank you, okay, yeah. Yeah. Drake, Drake he's can't just go a... Palmer, some of the best. He's not. He's he's more of a hype artist than a rapper. He's a he's a pop That's star. Fact. That's facts. Yeah. Drake I is mean, a pop star. Like, if you look at his songs, it's never been like bar after bar after bar. It's like one bar and that's it. I mean, like, I'm not, not, not that's it. Way. But it's like like Kendrick. You can see like five hidden bars in the song, let alone the ones you can actually see. Drake, you see maybe one or two, and you're like, oh, okay. okay. All right, is, is that it for everybody's unpopular opinion? Or anybody have any left? Do you get that thing going? I, I, I have a, I have an unpopular opinion. Uh, no, nah, it's not unpopular really unpopular. Opinion. I did not get that thing going down. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't have an unpopular opinion. I have a kind of popular opinion. Jakai doesn't have taste in anything. Yep. Not women, not opinion. <laughs> hey, unpopular opinion. You guys, ex girlfriend is a stick. <laughs> I'm a stick. She's a fucking brick. Hey, unpopular opinion. I'm looking at plenty of you guys exes right now. Trees. <laughs> All I gotta say is, compared to his seventh grade choices, they've slimmed down a quite quite a bit. <laughs> a lot, nigga. What the fuck? Hey, he went from what the fuck is Jakai doing? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Jakai doing a two C slide? Shit. <laughs> hey, but that's gonna do it for episode here. Get to go to Jakai, guys. Hope y'all motherfuckers enjoyed this shit. I'll catch y'all niggas later. All right.